Hey guys, Mitch here. Today we're going over the top 10 best city tweaks for the year 2012. Now this is part 9 of the series, and it does contain a mixture of both May and June city tweaks. So let's get into it. The first tweak is called Data, which allows you to get timestamps and image information for photos within your camera roll. So you can see at the bottom, it does display the time and the date of when each photo was taken or saved. Now if I go ahead and tap and hold on an a image you do see the image information and there will display some of the uh, details including the size the date created and the dimension of it the next city tweak is called unlock eyes which allows you to get some unlock methods for your device the first one is the fold to unlock which kind of makes the image into three different sections as you fold to unlock your device the second one is slice to unlock which allows you to basically slice the different columns as they do roll in as you slide to unlock your device. Pretty cool little uh, unlock there. The next one is fade to unlock. Basically allows you to fade as you unlock your device. It will fade in as you go back, it will fade back out. The next one is open blinds tall. This would open up the blinds as a tall window. As you can see, it does open them up vertically, up and down. And then the next unlock is the open blinds wide this would be the horizontal as you can see the blinds do open up in a horizontal movement and finally the last unlock method is checkered to unlock it kinda makes it into a checkerboard as you unlock from the top left all the way down to the bottom right now if you do have all the unlocks on it will be able to shuffle through them as you unlock your device so starting with the first one a full to unlock all the way down to the checkered to unlock in a seamless manner. So guys, this is Unlock Eyes. The next city tweak is called Safari Download Enabler and allows you to download things right from your Safari browser. This can be images, videos, songs. So in this case, I'm on a website here and if I hold down the download button, a new option will appear allowing me to download the linked file. Now if I go ahead and select that, it will open up a new tab here and this will allow me to open up the file, in this case a song, using iFile. So you must have iFile already installed or a similar app. And if I go ahead and open up an iFile, it will use the audio player extension, allowing me to listen to my song. Or if I did download a video, it will install a video player, allowing me to watch my video. So guys, this is Safari Download Enabler. The next city tweak is called No Carrier Name, and it's a very simple tweak. Basically allows you to remove the carrier name in the top left hand corner of your device without having to install Winterboard. Now Winterboard will usually slow down your device. And with this, all it is a tweak, and once installed you will see that my AT&T is now removed, allowing me to just see the Wi-Fi or the status bars of my connection. If you are on Bell, Verizon, or any other carrier, that carrier will be removed in a seamless manner. The next city tweak is called Paper Lock and is another lock screen tweak that allows you to unlock your device using some cool effects. The first one here is the Band-Aid allowing me to slide to unlock. The second one is using a full page, which is the default one. You slide from anywhere left or right depending where you do have the anchor position. You can have that on the left or the right. And last but not least, we also have the plastic tab. Now you can have the camera option still there so you can still access the camera by going up or you can easily slide to unlock, or in this case, peel to unlock your device. The next city tweak is called Mountain Lion Center, and this allows you to get the notification center for your iPad on the right hand side. You can use two fingers or three fingers. And in addition to this, the banner notifications do stretch from all the way from the left hand side of your device all the way to the right hand side device, taking up the entire length. The next city tweak is called Facebook This, which allows you to get Facebook integration right into iOS 5. Now iOS 6 is already incorporating Facebook integration, but if you're still on iOS 5, Facebook This might be for you. You can see we do have the new Facebook integration here. If you go ahead and select that, you can go ahead and type out your message here. So in this case, it is a iPhone 5 alleged photo here of the back plate. And if I go ahead and select OK, it will take me to Facebook on my Safari browser and here you can see that we do have the iPhone 5 picture on Facebook in a seamless manner. So guys this is Facebook this. 
Our next city tweak is called Animate Lock Screen, which allows you to get some animations for your device's lock screen. So you can see we do have the Mac OS X 10 little animation here, and the other one is the Angry Birds here slowed down. Now all of these Animate Lock Screens can be downloaded from Cydia in the add-on sections, and it does use the Chronic Devs Team's boot logo as an add-on. All these extras can be downloaded in City, like I said, and you do have two built-in ones that do come with the Aboot logos, and you can customize these all in City to your liking. Our next City tweak is called iOS 6 Photos Menu, which allows you to get an iOS 6 Photos Menu right for your iOS 5 device. Now, if you go ahead and select the bottom left-hand image there, you can see we now have a redefined sharing options here, including mail, message, we can assign to a contact. Our three options do include our social networking sites, and then you have your basic options at the bottom, such as print, copy, or you can go ahead and assign to the wallpaper here, so you can easily scale and move like before. In the middle, we do have our social networking sites, including Twitter, Facebook, and Google+. If you go ahead and tweet out the message, it will incorporate a Twitter sheet here. You can go ahead and send out your message. We do have Facebook integration thanks to Facebook This and an add-on with Google+. So guys, this is iOS 6 Photos menu. Our next city tweak is called AppSent, which allows you to get a percentage of the download progress as you download App Store apps. So if I go ahead here and install an app, you will see that in this case the app flow will start at 0%, and as it begins to download, the increase in percentage will happen here. So I have sped this up a little bit, and you can see that it does go from 8% to 13% back up to 25 and as it's finished here it will bounce up to hundred percent showing me that my app has been downloaded so guys this is app sent this has been the top 10 best city tweaks for the year 2012 and this is part 9 of the series if any of these tweaks did go fast I will have links in the description for a more in-depth review of each city tweak if you guys do like these videos don't forget to give a like up leave any comments below and don't forget to subscribe to stay updated thanks guys